fact is that computers have been around for a long time, but they were mostly crunching numbers and giving us statistics. But now you can make pictures with them. And once you can make pictures, you can see impossible things. do is use the technology to make it look as if we were really someplace and really shot it. That's what our goals are in terms of technology, is to not, not draw attention to it, but in fact to create the illusion for the moviegoer and for us when we go to the films that we're sucked up by the story and don't pay attention to the techniques of the effects. The computer simulation is like a new kind of organ that's been designed and it's a matter of us all learning how to play these tools. One of the things that we had to do was the human figure because it's the thing that is traditionally avoided. It's the most difficult thing to do because it's the thing that we're all most familiar with, but it's also the most interesting thing. But what I was interested in was just doing a figure that was believable enough that anyone looking at him would understand the potential, that would say, aha, if he looks that good now, you know, five to 10 years from now, I mean, you can imagine how much better he'll be. The thing is that Adam can be a lot of different people, that he can do, you know, lots of magic things. I would really like to get him an agent, you know. Watch out! <laughs>